Right now, breaking news on News Channel 8. The search is on tonight for two people who officials think may have drowned. Good evening, I'm Allison Henning. I'm Jack Royer. Thank you for joining us tonight. Right now, the Polk County Sheriff's Office is working with the FWC to find those people at Lake Eloise in Winter Haven. That is where News Channel 8's Trevor Sahaki is live tonight with the status of this apparently ongoing search. Trevor. Jack Allison, the Polk County Sheriff's Office, is now using sonar to continue this search and recovery mission throughout the rest of the night. The lake is over here on my left. It's pretty much pitch, pitch black at this point, so we can't really see much, but we can make out a recovery boat with the flashing lights in the middle of the water. Once they got here, they were out on the water and they were they were searching right away. A hectic scene today for anglers at Lake Eloise and Lake Summit in Winter Haven. And then all before you know it, that are pulling in the parking lot. First two sheriff cars, then then a couple of re a rescue squad, a fire engine. There, there was probably five engines here. The Polk County Sheriff's Marine Unit and Florida Fish and Wildlife Conservation Commission are searching for two adults who officials think drowned in Lake Eloise this afternoon. Unfortunately, there's a lot of people that are crazy on the water, and there's no common courtesy. David Phillips fishes in these lakes every week. He says some people are careless on the water. Somebody else may have caused, you know, uh, awake or was too close and that's what caused them to fall over the boat. He heard sirens and saw ambulances, rescue boats and a helicopter around five o'clock. The biggest thing was we're worried for human life. You know what I mean? Are they going to find us? I mean at that point we considered should we offer to help but at that point we decided it was best to leave it to the professionals. Phillips said today like every weekend all the lakes in this area were very popular. If you come down here on a weekend this parking lot in which we're in you will find boats scattered all the way from one end to the other. And police are also asking people to avoid using the Lake Summit boat ramp as well as uh, going to Lake Summit as well as Lake Eloise at this point until officials give the okay. Live in Winter Haven, Trevor Sahaki, 8 on your side. All right, Trevor, thank you very much.